workflow framework makes technical debt, makes debts and risks a first class part of, of the way that, that you, you manage delivery. What we're doing with these portfolio insights is that you can actually champion it and take pride in those technical debt efforts at a business level. So what you're able to do is actually get visibility across your organization on how much is being invested in technical debt in which part of the portfolio. And keep in mind that the whole point of product thinking is you don't do the same thing for all parts of the portfolio. You empower the teams to say, okay, we can best meet our business objectives by spending, let's say, 30% of this release cycle on technical debt, whereas another team might only have to spend 10. It might be a newer product with uh, less legacy and, and less problems of that sort. So you now get visibility on this at the actual organizational level, at the portfolio level, and even more importantly, you get to connect that investment in things like technical debt reduction with business results. And to say, okay, this, this tech debt investment actually helped us go considerably faster. So we've actually been able to elevate all of this systemically across the organization to not only help teams champion tech debt, but to help leadership support that and see the results and communicate those results to the business.